secretariat of a local government was packed full with family members of the late vice chairman of the local government, Uyi Amego. The management and staff of the local government, politicians that cut across party lines, friends and well-wishers who came to pay their last respects to the late Ego local government vice chairman. In their various remarks, the vice chairman of Ego local government was described as a perfect gentleman. I've been very proud to the very many testimonies about the life he led since his passing on. He was humility personified. We lived a good life. How many of us can live that type of life before we die? Whatever I have achieved today as a local government chairman of the Southwest, in terms of humility, I learned a lot from you. I wish you well where you are. I know you are resting in the bosom of our Lord Jesus Christ. The officiating minister, Apostle John Okoyomo, who is also the PFM leader in the local government, described the late Uyi Amego as a leader who followed the footsteps of Christ diligently, while the chairman of the local government, Ege Ogbemudia, named a hall after the late vice chairman, which attracted applause from guests present. Honorable Uyi Amego has gone to be with his creator. So I want to admonish you not to be too sorrowful. The promise we made together and we make that history. And people will remember the year and the time you became the vice chairman of the local government by God's grace. We goodbye for now. Until we meet again when we pass no more. This song today is not named after Uyi. It's not going to be known as Uyi Amego Hall forever and ever in Jesus' name. In an interview, some local government functionaries said the late Uyi Amego would be greatly missed because of his promises to Ego people to deliver dividends of democracy. The downpour notwithstanding, the workers did turn out a man to pay their last respect to him because he was a great man. He's been working with the chairman harmoniously right from the session of the administration. He was a very, very calm young man. The body of late Uyi Amega was later conveyed in a motorcade for interment. There was a live reception for guests at Uyi Grand Event Center on Erunse off Ekewa Road, Benin City. The late vice chairman of the local government died at the age of 44 after a brief illness. Best Mbire reporting.